Ladies and gentlemen, it's been a while. It's the heat is coming. It's summer, and I haven't streaming lately. Plus, my capture card has some issues, so another one's on the way. But a new Elden Ring trailer just dropped, and I'm curious to see what it has. Now, normally I'd be worried about trailers giving me too much information, but this is not Square Enix, so I'm fine. Which, by the way, do not watch. The Kingdom Hearts Steam announcement, if you haven't played Kingdom Hearts before, it's a fair warning. They, Square Enix tend to spoil a lot of stuff in their trailers, so yeah, I just wanted to say that. But anyway, let's dive into this video and see what happens. All right, all right. The volume Day should 16. be okay. At least I hope. Yeah, I think so. Mikula the Kind spoke of the beginning. Ooh. The seduction. That corpse? And the betrayal. Got a golden hair? Is this rot? Probably. An affair from which gold arose. Oh, uh, yeah. I remember that now. And so too was Shadow born. There was a sword like that. What it had like was limbs, little limbs like that. One that could never be put to song. Is that supposed to be someone? I don't know. That's was in the previous trailer that character the tyranny was this before the fall like like before the end game stuff got badass over here The, yeah, that's a tree. I thought it was like arms doing this. And so kindly, Mikula would abandon everything. Hmm. That one's different. It's like a moon with a cross on it. His golden flesh. His blinding strength. Even his faith. Hmm. This is heavy story trailer. Are these characters you're going to meet in the game? The expansion? Probably. If you're not in too much on the on the lore, you're probably super confused of what's happening. June 21st. Jeez. It's a month away. Less than a month away. Alright. I'm not much into the lore. I just learn from other people. Also, this pre-order statue. I'm not getting that. However, let's go back a bit and muted. Um, when I said this was before the fall, there's a, if you haven't played the game, there is a certain moment where you return to, well, how would I explain it? There's a certain part of the game where you go to the sky and then when you defeat one of the main bosses in that area, you return to the ground, and then you find yourself in a place that you used to be there before, but now it's covered in so what I call uh, sand, that it could be ash. Is this the expansion? We're gonna go in that part of the era? 
or we're gonna investigate exactly what happened, who survived, and we're gonna meet the characters that we saw in the end of the trailer. Huh. I wonder, I mean, this is the perfect trailer for hyping everyone up. It doesn't really give away anything like most companies do in their trailers, and I want to know who's that. I want to know who's that. That pose and everything like a dragoon. Hmm. I, I feel like you're that person is more threatening than the flagship character we have in this expansion. I don't know. Probably a bot. Could be an airline, could be an enemy, could be a gray character, morally gray character, who knows. Um I'm very stoked. Even Yoshi P, the person who made Final Fantasy XIV great, is really hyped for this. And I said that I like the Crescent Moon design, because before, well, we saw it before, it's like, like, that, and then this. Not across, but under the half moon, in the middle, there was like a line signifying an Elden Ring or something like that. Don't quote me on that, I'm not heavy on the lore. But I wonder what that symbol represents. Is that an opposing party who uses the same energy? Or is this an, uh, like a new evolution of the same crest? And sorry, my dog is barking if you're hearing that. I feel like we're gonna meet those characters. For sure. I hope they're fun. I hope they're fun. What am I saying? This is a Miyazaki game. Miyazaki game? Did I say that right? I'm confusing it with that someone else. Probably. It's a From Software game, so it's gonna be good. Anyway. Really excited. June 21st. 21st. <sighs> English. June 21st can't come fast enough. But I'm willing to wait. I hope I can get the art book someday, but anyway, that's really great. Let me know in the comments of things you picked up on this trailer, and again, any speculations, because I would love to know. Uh, again, I'm not heavy on the lore stuff. I only looked for Blyde and Ronnie, because those are the characters that I was mostly interested in, but the rest, uh, not so much. But yeah, anyway, thank you for watching, and see y'all when I see ya. Bye.